What is up, beautiful people of the world? We are Pop R&B Group Reverse. My name is Justice. I'm Khadija. My name's Zach. And I'm Monroe. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> um, hi, everybody. It's me. Um, and I'm here with my family, and I'm here with you all today. Uh, just wanted to give you all a little bit of an update. Um, but first and foremost, before I get into that, I just want to thank everybody who has taken the time to first of all watch my video and listen to my story and everything that's going on with me and um, also taking the time to write messages um, not only on the video but like sending me personal DMs and um, to those who know me know me very well like sending me private messages and I just want to say thank you so much um, it's overwhelming to read so many beautiful comments and warm well wishes that people send you. And uh, during hard times, it really does make you feel loved. And that in itself was super emotional to read. And I'm very, very, very grateful to have such an incredible support around me. Um, everyone here and um, everyone watching the video and not me gonna cry because <laughs> Brittany, ew. Um, but seriously, thank you. Um, it means a lot. Um, so I'm here uh, and um, I had my surgery and just a quick little update on that. I actually thought about like, do I wanna get into detail and do I wanna say, um, but I think it's so important for me to be transparent mm -hmm. because not only did I get a lot of people messaging me, you know, hoping that I'm going to do well and that I, you know, wishing me well, um, there are a lot of people who messaged me saying that they have been through this, who know people who have been through this and are struggling with it. And so I feel like. I owe the transparency to, to say like, this is my story. This is what happened to me. And this is what's going to uh, happen mm -hmm. moving forward. So I went in for my surgery bright and early. Um, I didn't get a sleep, no sleep at all. But basically um, they put me under and the surgery, surgery is normally a two hour surgery. My surgery ended up being five hours. Um, and the reason being is because when they opened me up, they found that the cancer was spreading to my trachea. And um, the surgeon, who is a fantastic, fantastic surgeon, I'm so grateful for him. Uh, he told me this when I, actually he told me this as soon as I like woke up my eyes. And I was like, girl, I am so high on all the drugs right now. <laughs> I cannot compute anything that you're saying. Um, but he told, my parents told me after, but essentially what happened was um, it had spread. So he just kept taking it out and then would find more. And then he would take it out and he would find more. And it was deep going deeper and deeper and deeper into like my collarbone area. Um, he took everything out. Um, but that is why my surgery took longer. Um, and he was quite surprised as to how long it had been living in me and with no doctors uh, doing checkups on me or anything like that. Um, essentially, he said that the cancer had been living in me for five years. And he was incredibly shocked. I was incredibly shocked. And when he told me that and when my parents told me that, I just remember sitting in the bed being like, that's five years that I had no idea that something was trying to like kill me slowly. Um, and like mentally, it's kind of hard to like say it out loud um, because I'm not in the clear um, as much as, you know, I want to think that I am. I am, <laughs> let me rephrase that. I am, um, but they want to take, um, more precautions and do more tests and to make sure that nothing else has um, spread and that I'm good. Um, I will be doing like chemo treatments. Um, the good thing about this chemo treatment that they're gonna be giving me is that it's in a form of a pill. So I won't be um, having too many of the side effects that normally come with chemotherapy. Um, and this is all just precaution to make sure that everything is zapped away and everything is good. Um, 
but yes, I am healing. I am still me. I'm here on this couch. The sun still shines and still rises as it does every day. And I am going to continue uh, healing. I'm going to continue fighting. And I just want everyone out there to know that whatever life throws at you, you are capable of achieving anything you want in your life. And with love and support around you, anything is possible. So thank you so much for, again, all of the love. I really appreciate it. And thank you for fighting with me and not making me feel like I'm alone. Um, and I don't feel alone. So thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> no. <laughs> Thanks, guys. I still haven't sung yet. Yeah, yeah so. Uh, uh, Chill. <laughs> it's been, it's been. I know. That's it's just one more thing. Sorry. Not minutes. goodbye. Um, I still haven't sung anything yet. Mm -hmm. um, so I don't really know where my voice is. Uh, but I know she's there. She's just taking a break. She's tired, girl. Mm -hmm. She's been singing her whole life. Mm -hmm. So she's just taking a break. Um, but we'll be back and we'll be strong. And I'll sing a playlist or not <laughs> very soon. <laughs> and yes. So I forgot to mention that. <laughs> Um, thank you guys so much. I love you. Bye.